All right, uh, afternoon, morning, evening. Hi, everybody. Uh, this is Mark. This side. Uh, in today's tutorial, we're gonna I'm gonna show you how to create letterhead. Not necessarily create. Uh, I did it in a previous tutorial. Uh, today, I'm gonna show you how you can export your letterhead and send to your clients or use it or whatever if it's for client for yourself anybody boss company colleague whoever so this is how you do it i'm gonna start doing it now uh let me adjust this volume a little bit so you can hear me properly i guess it's better now so we're gonna need two things for this tutorial whatever you do your video i don't uh, it doesn't really mind i mean it doesn't matter so i'm gonna use indesign for that here's my indesign and apart from this i'm gonna use uh, microsoft office as well which is here uh, this is where i'm gonna drag or export my letterhead into so anybody can add it and use it as they want and as well as i don't know how you call this if it's file manager folder whatever but this i'm gonna put my letterhead here so i'm gonna go to my indesign i'm gonna use uh, which artwork for this example? Okay, let me use this one. So I'm gonna use this letterhead uh, in this example. Uh, it's opening. Oh, here it is. It's open. So this is the letterhead I did uh, for my client, DRN. And. So I did, I did four different designs and they want to use this one. This is the one they want to use. Let me close this one. So this is the one. And if I go to my pages, uh, this one is page number two. So on page number two, this is the option they want to use. Uh, this letterhead so I'm just gonna click on file export and under export I'm gonna put it and uh, okay my folder open this side let me bring it here I actually exported already uh, but for now I don't wanna mix there I'm just gonna go to my images camera roll or saved pictures you can save any way you want it doesn't really matter I'm gonna say here DRN letterhead maybe final and I'm gonna save and make sure it's in JPEG if it's not in JPEG you can click on type JPEG and then save make sure everything is the way my is you save it and then this guy is gonna pop up uh, the range is page 2 I don't wanna export all of this the quality I'll make sure it's maximum progressive uh, resolution it can be 300 rgb is fine make sure this looks like this and then you say export after exporting i'm gonna go to my folder i guess it's already done let me go to my folder uh pictures or images and i put it in saved pictures it's already there here it is so this is my letterhead if i make it bigger you'll be able to see exported and i'm gonna go now i'm done with indesign so i can actually close it or you can do whatever you want i'm not gonna save this because i don't know what i did there but in your case you can save uh, let me close this one and then if i go to my word document i open a new one i open a new word document i'm gonna try to make it as short as i can this is a new word document before we drag our file in uh, the first thing we do is we change the page size we go to page and layout right here so under page and layout we're gonna change the page size because Microsoft Office normally give you a letter as a size majority of the time which is currently on or active I'm gonna go up to A4 this is the one we wanna use so A4 is the right size. Uh, I don't know in the country where I am, we use A4 papers. <laughs> I'm not so sure about where you are. 
So use A4 and I'm gonna go to my folder where the letterhead is and I'm gonna drag just like this. I'm gonna drag my letterhead image JPEG into Word just like that and I can as well just close this I think I'm done with that so from here if I click on it this is how it shows it's this is the letterhead the letterhead is done design we're just basically exporting to send to the client so they are able to write and do whatever they want so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to wrap option we're gonna go to wrap and we say behind the text behind text it means that we can now drag it the way we want anywhere so we're gonna make sure it goes to the upper left corner and then we uh, make it bigger we resize it to the actual size of the page like this our uh, letterhead is done but uh, sorry uh, it's actually done but here is not where you leave your letterhead right so I'm just gonna remove this because I actually made a mistake but don't worry it's very light small I'm just gonna say control X of not to complicate you I can do it again because if I put it here it means that my heading and footer is not uh, in the video so I'm gonna double click on top here can you see here I'm gonna double click here when you see header and footer now you can drag your image Oops, uh, uh, you can also go to quick access which it shows you the last file you saved on your computer or you opened or you used uh, let me close this one and then I'm gonna say wrap under the format group text wrap text behind now it's good now it's good so I can put it in this corner and I can drag down here to this corner as well and my letterhead is done when I'm doing when I after doing this I double click here somewhere not on top of the image and not on the heading as well just somewhere here or here I'm gonna double click here and I'm not again on my body of the letterhead so here if you check closely uh, let me zoom in a bit there is the size of the heading which is here so I'm gonna reduce this size of the head in two here below the letter head and I'm gonna go to the footer and I'm also gonna resize this for the size I can put it somewhere here depending if you have something on the footer you can see how you can do it but for me it's okay like this and then now I'm able to start writing uh, I don't know if you write right like this from uh, to uh, maybe dear whatever and then I can put the body here text text here and I can literally just copy this guy text here and do like this text here text here I'm gonna do this text here, 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 here. So uh, this is how your letterhead is gonna look like. I can actually just copy this. So it will be something like that. And and then you can put your signature or whatever. So and then you can say file, uh, save. And then it's gonna ask you to choose where you wanna save uh, desktop let me just put it under document you can choose to save anywhere you want right uh, in this case I'm just gonna save and uh, document where should I save uh, let me put on the same image where I put the previous one which is camera roll farming i can save here so here i'm gonna say uh d r n head word 
I save and then after that my letterhead is saved you can choose to send to the clients like this uh, I normally just delete everything that is on it and I just save and the letterhead is done if I close you can send via email whatsapp whatever you want if I go to the folder again I can right click on the last file quick access and say open file location it's gonna show you me where they are so here uh, the two this is as an image and this is in word document every time you open it's already set up ready to be used well organized so you can just use and continue so this is basically how you do your letterhead uh, a friend of mine one of my learner students uh, asked me to uh, show them how they can do this I think I actually got four requests so I hope it was not too long and I hope it was quick and easy to be understood and follow uh, 10 minutes I hope it's not so bad so enjoy it and have a good day